hi welcome back to my channel in this video i'm going to show you how to make this really cute flowy high low wrap skirt it is super easy and you can use this tutorial to make this skirt for anyone you like if you haven't already please subscribe to my channel for a new video every monday for this project you will need 3.5 yards of a lightweight fabric like rayon or crepe a measuring tape, scissors, pins, and a sewing machine. Now let's get started. For this project, we will need three main measurements. One being the waist, and the other being the front length and the back length. Since this is a high-low skirt, the front length will be smaller than the back length. Back length is from waist to ankle and front length is from waist to knee or below the knee for the waist measurement wrap the tape around the waist halfway through to get the wrap over part of the skirt in my case this was around 51 inches now for the total waist measurement add one inch of seam allowance for the waist and divide this by 3.14 the waistband for the skirt is going to be 2 inches, so we need to first subtract this from the total length of the skirt. So the total front length is going to be front length minus 2 inches plus the total waist. Similarly, the total back length is going to be back length minus 2 inches plus the total waist. Let's start by folding the fabric half in length. Place the measuring tape on the right angle corner of the folded fabric. Now use the measurement that we got by dividing the waist length by 3.14 and mark it as shown. This is how the markings are going to be. The total back length in my case is 34 inches. Mark this back length on the folded side of the fabric. The front length in my case is 22 inches. Mark this front length on the open edge of the folded fabric. Taper and join all these marks to get half circle which is low and high in the front and back. This is how you need to mark the half circle pattern. Go ahead and cut along the markings. At this stage, wrap the skirt around you and measure the front length and check to see if you want to reduce it a little more. I decided to reduce it a little more and this is how I marked and cut it to get my desired front length. While altering the front length, make sure you do not cut the waist measurement. When you are happy with the front length, go ahead and hem the raw bottom edge of the skirt by double folding it. I am using simple straight stitch for this entire project. Now open the skirt fully and measure the waist measurement. Using this measurement, we will be cutting the waistband. For the waistband, fold the fabric in half. Since we will fold the waistband in half widthwise, we need to take 5 inches in width. In my case, the entire waist measurement came to be 16 inches. So we will be cutting a piece of fabric that's 5 inches in width and 16 inches in length. Go ahead and start cutting. Cut a small piece of the fabric and use that as the template to cut the entire 60 length piece with a width of 5 inch. Now let's go ahead and cut strings to tie the waistband. For this we need two long strips of fabric that are 3 inches in wide and 60 inches in length. 
to make the tie string fold quarter inch to the center and another quarter inch to center and fold these two in half make a straight stretch on the open side of the string repeat the same for the other tie string too now take the waistband that we cut earlier which is 5 inches in width and 60 inches in length with right side of the fabric of the band facing up place the tie string at the center and fold the band in half this way the wrong side would be towards outside and the right side would be inside pin the drawstring in place and sew the raw edge to attach drawstring to the waistband repeat this procedure on both ends of the waistband now turn the right side out to expose the drawstring neatly attached to the waistband now open the skirt fully with the right side facing up now place the raw edge of the waistband on the waist of the skirt and pin them in place now all that is left to do is sew the waistband to the skirt using the straight stitch there you have it a stylish flowy wrap around skirt which is high at the back and low in the front you can customize this according to your measurements please subscribe for more such diy and sewing videos thanks for watching see you in my next video